my view, GSR is one of those uh, once a year uh, opportunities for many of us from uh, regulatory bodies to, to come together and exchange views, uh, you know, put forward our views as well uh, on common issues of, in issues of common interest. Uh, for example, uh, one thing which is topical right now is spectrum management and also investment in future broadband networks. Many of us have the same challenges as regulators, but uh, the solutions that we may have to put in our own uh, respective jurisdictions may well be different depending on the circumstances, the market and the economic conditions of the country. Yes, thank you. Uh, f we have been, uh, in Malaysia, we've been focusing a lot on uh, the concept of public-private partnership in the rollout of infrastructure. Uh, we have uh, one major uh, uh, initiative called the National Broadband Initiative where in the cities uh, the government partners with one of the incumbent telecoms operators to roll out fiber uh, to the homes and in the rural areas we have a partnership with many other uh, service providers via the Universal Service Fund where we provide uh, a minimal amount of subsidy for them to provide connectivity uh, via usually wireless means to the rural areas. Uh, we've been doing that since 2008 uh, and 9. We've seen some interesting results come out. Uh, for example, the uh, mobile broadband coverage in the year 2009 was about 70-odd um, percent of the populated areas in Malaysia. Now I'm happy to say at the end of 2012, early 2013, we've hit almost 97% of the populated areas. Uh, going on, what we have to do is now look at upgrading those networks from uh, um, HSPA or 3G networks up to 4G. So there's a lot more work to be done, but uh, we're quite happy with uh, what's, what the progress has been up to now. But I should also say in, in the work that I've been involved with with the Broadband Commission, uh, at the end of the day, once a country reaches a certain critical mass in so far as uh, broadband penetration is concerned, you have to answer the question of what else do you do with the broadband infrastructure. And we, uh, and I'm here here in Poland uh, this week, uh, in fact I'll be speaking tomorrow about how uh, regulators, industry, governments need to focus more on applications development, content development, because at the end of the day, uh, it is the content and the applications that helps generate the next level of uh, uh, ARPU for the service providers. I'm actually very, very excited about the next uh, growth cycle in Malaysia. Uh, now that we've uh, reached a certain level of critical mass and so far as broadband uh, coverage and penetration is concerned, the big focus will be on content and applications development. Uh, I believe that will be the next growth cycle for the industry and uh, for, for us, uh, we've always taken the view that uh, a public-private partnership approach between uh, government and regulators and also the operators will be the, the way forward uh, in developing the country and in particular the telecom sector.